Here's what's visible in the night sky for August. First up, the Perseids, one of the year's best meteor showers, and it's gonna be peaking August 11th to the 13th with up to 100 meteors per hour. The moon's a little bit bright this year, so you're gonna to wanna to try and look for the meteors uh, more like in the early morning hours and in an area with dark skies away from light pollution. And while you're meteor hunting between August 11th and the 13th, you could also catch Venus and Jupiter. It's going to look absolutely beautiful. They're gonna be very close together, looking east just before sunrise. And then on August 20th, you have the crescent moon that's going to be joining Venus and Jupiter. Beautiful triangle. On August 19th, you can catch Mercury. It's going to be visible in the morning sky, low on the eastern horizon. And mark your calendars for August 23rd. This is going to be the new moon. So this is going to be your chance to see some amazing dark sky objects, possibly even the Milky Way overhead, because the sky is going to be really dark. For the best views, head to dark sky parks like Cherry Springs or Big Bend or high altitude spots in Arizona or New Mexico. And just find a dark spot, open sky, and look up. Hoping for clear skies for all of you. We catch a shooting star, make a wish. Happy stargazing.